so hello everyone in this video we are going to complete uh, the third topic in this list which is SCROI so SCROI uh, was called as by Hutton he called him, him as father of Indian ethnology so Hutton called SCROI as the father of Indian ethnology his main uh, area of focus was Chota Nagpur Plateau and uh, the area of his interest were tribal work now he also in the later phase of his life he used anthropology in order to study the na nation building concept so this is something uh, which is actually important then uh, if we start from him i don't think sc roy will be asked till 2024 for that matter uh, the main reason for this is that this question has already been repeated in 2021 so as a no short note on SRO it can come but the other topics uh, it's not that much of relevance so 1912 it was the first uh, monologue that he basically put monograph it was on the mundas then in 1915 he actually did the orans 1960 he basically excavated the asur site okay and 1920 he laid down the principles of physical anthropology and now the studies from like Oran, Asur's Asur uh, study was uh, kind of a helpful thing uh, in order to streamline the prehistoric and proto-historic events. Okay, Oran's uh, basically for the social life, social and cultural life. Uh, the principles of physical anthropology were someone uh, which helped them understand the better version of anthropology. Uh, he established or he started this journal called as man in india which is one of the most renowned uh, journal as far as the anthropology is concerned in the year 1925 he again went with a monograph on birbur 1928 here basically the focus was on uh, for example uh, say the th whatever the verbal and non-verbal communication happens in a culture or in a society this particular community Birbor was you know responsible in or for SC Roy to get these things out next in the year 1928 most of the focus was shifted to this concept of a culture acculturation and that on orans so what is acculturation will be doing in cultural processes when we'll be moving the to the paper one but you have to understand what acculturation is so these are two cultures so this culture will basically be will be imposing itself on this culture B and that is in just understanding acculturation and this B will lose its own culture. In 1935 or uh, 34 his some interest changed and he went in order to understand the caste, race and religion in India. In 1937 he studied the community called as Kharia and he basically he went for uh, learning the socio cultural and physical anthropological data now what do i mean by socio cultural uh, and physical anthropological data is that socio cultural uh, data is related to their life their daily activity various institutions like marriage family kinship uh, their belief system folk tales and etc physical anthropological data that includes the diseases uh, the sort of uh, you know racial mixture if it, there is any some serological e events like blood etc so this is something where major apart from that various uh, data on somatotyping as well as on uh, anthropometry was also con uh, you know taken into consideration so SRO is definitely one of the most important topic as far as UPC 2023 or 2024 is concerned so if you're doing it you should have SRO in your uh, bucket list so Yes, this was about SROI. In the next video, we will be doing NK Boss.